One of my Facebook friends wrote the other day, I just got cut off and almost had an accident by a car that has Jesus says repent, repent your sins written in English and Hebrew on the rear windshield. Mr. Bilingual Jesus Freak didn't even apologize. Is that what Jesus would do? Well, if you're public about who you are, you can get away with much less. People are always quick to call out bad behavior by publicly identifying Jews, Christians, or Muslims, or anyone else as their identity on their sleeve, particularly if that identity carries with it a well-defined behavioral system. People act a lot better in public if, if they are easily identified. Um, just think about those employees who, who drive around with signs on the back prominently plastered on the back that this is a phone number to call if you're concerned about this person's driving. So I love hypocrisy. Hypocrisy means there are standards. Hypocrisy means we're failing to live up to what we believe in. Without these ideals, without these standards, there's less stri striving for higher moral ground. Thinking about a typical secular liberal, how can they be a hypocrite if they smoke cocaine, drink to excess, commit adultery, cheat on their taxes? They're not being hypocritical because they're not publicly identifying with a transcendent value system. 